this is Microbotic. It's designed for young learners to explore coding, which is great. Except today, it's in the hands of two overgrown children with a single goal in mind. Our mission? Make it through four checkpoints and return to the start. How hard could it be? So this robot has got LEDs, a buzzer, five line sensors and two high speed motors. Plus, it works with M-Block. It's beginner friendly. You code it using blocks. Meant for children. But again, two overgrown adults are playing with it. Which is good, I think. Because we're even we're still figuring this out. The track that we are using is for a competition for Microbotic Autonomous Line Following Robot. We had a plan. The robot needed to pass through four checkpoints here, 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 and here, and come back to the start. Sounds simple, right? We coded the robot using M-Block. If you wanted to detect a junction, you would use a Pathfinder block or a Pathfinder tank block. If you wanted to follow the line without caring for any junctions, intersections, you just use the line tracer time. Things were going okay ish. <laughs> Our time was spent testing values, adjusting turns, and raging. On one occasion, the robot was doing well, following the logic that we programmed. But sometimes, it's as if the robot has a mind of its own. Now we sort of generally figured out the problem. The momentum that it brings from this here makes the robot unstable. So it makes, makes, messes up. Oh yeah, okay, so it messes up all of this parts right here. So we figured out the problem, now we have to find a solution for it. In the end, after some trial, error, and debugging that made us question everything, I finally got a decent run, but my friend had to work a little bit hard. After more discussion, he too got a decent run, albeit not the whole track yet, but I do believe he'll get there eventually. To wrap it all up, we had one last idea, a 45 minute challenge who can make the robot go the farthest on a given route. 
No pressure, no stakes, just two people racing for absolutely no reason. of our challenge for today. <laughs> At the end of the day, we actually learned a lot and had a lot of fun doing it. Turns out, you don't need a high-end robot to get a solid learning experience or to trigger a mini existential crisis. <laughs> 10 out of 10, I would do this all again and with my best friend at my side. Until the next time. That's all for now. Thanks for watching. Ha 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 ha!